What's up, nerds and nerdettes and wee little nerdlings all? It's your buddy, Big John G. The Two Gun Pixel presents Legendary Gaming. Woo! It's been a long day, and I'm glad to be here with you. Alright, so thank you very much everyone that's been subscribing to Two Gun Pixie. It's very nice, it's very cool that we, uh, that we see that. Awesome! Because you know we drop a video every day, so you might as well hit the subscribe and hit that bell. You also, thank you so much, have been checking us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. <laughs> wow, that is so nice that you do that. Thank you so much for seeing what we're like over there. Isn't a lot different, a little bit, but thank you. Also, we have our merch at our official Two Gun Pixie Zazzle store. <laughs> and uh, thank you very much as well for taking the time to go take a look, see what's there. Even if you didn't buy anything, you took a moment to look. Wow, thank you so much. But enough of the pleasantries. We're here for something far more fun. We're here to find out what's in the Pixie's box. <laughs> All right, so, uh, well, not much of a surprise if you tuned in last week, because we have another Pandasaurus title, my friends, and this is the direct expansion sequel. Woo! Woo! Totally liquid! <laughs> hey! But Dinosaur Island. So this adds a, a fifth player and aquatic dinosaurs. Ooh. Maybe they'll have some planktosaurs in there. <laughs> All right, my friends. So I'm going to get this down to the table. I'll meet you down there, and we'll find out what's in the Pixie's box. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you for joining me down at the table for this unboxing of Pandasaurus Games Expansion. Big box expansion for Dinosaur Island called Dinosaur Island Totally Liquid. This was designed by Jonathan Gilmore, Brian Lewis, and Ian Moss. Two to five players, 90 to 120 minutes for ages eight and up with solo rules. Just like the core game, you saw unboxed here last week. Same principle, same setup. Ooh, a little camera quake. <laughs> All right, my friends. Why don't we... Why don't we get this baby opened and see what's going on. All right, Foo, let's... Thank you very much. Now we're going to get you out of the splash zone. Totally liquid. So, my friends, I am so ready to check this out. Woo! Adds a fifth player. Adds aquatic dinosaurs. Very cool. Always cut away from yourself. Okay, now this box is a little bit lighter from the original. The original's a little hefty, actually. This one, not as much. But yeah, this, you can still feel everything in it. Then again, this has four boards for the players. This only has the one. All right, so the rule book. Nice, it's set up just like Oh, executive points with their little canes. Just like uh, the actor in the movie, the old guy, Attenborough. Yeah, it's set up just like the last rule book, which wasn't that bad to get through. It was actually fairly easy. So I'm assuming this will be as well. Oh, 
Cool. So, let's see how many, not quite as many boards. Okay, now we got the new player board down. Moria Labs Global. It's the new team on the scene. Yeah, again, like I was saying last week uh, for the unboxing, I love the dual boards. So they cut the slots out here to hold the tracker cubes in. Very nice. And of course, we're going to need a new play area for Moria Labs. With a new dice. There we go. See, I'm still digging that amber color. Very cool. Woo woo! Still think these dice are a tad large. But I've been learning to live with it. So a bag of bags. Okay, so here goes those uh, executive meeples. There he goes. Plastic. Some more plastic cubes. Some more of the ranch hands. Specialists. Yep, plastic. In case you're wondering. And some more patrons. Gotta generate that money. Like Alice Cooper said, make that money. Okay. Let's check out these cards. Okay, so herbivores. Oh, top secret. Shh. I shouldn't be showing these. My life is in danger. That's all you're allowed to see. <laughs> Well, some top secret cards. Large carnivore. Small carnivore. Large carnivores eat other vores. Well, the executives. Boss hog. <laughs> chief dino officer. Money bags. Security chief. Corporate spy. Technical advisor, dino breeder, and jack of both trades. Ooh, interesting. We also have some more specialists, I see. The lawyer, the rent a cop, food stall CEO, merchandise CEO, the ride CEO, research scientist. Master Mixologist? Is that a bar? Social Media Manager? And venture Capitalist? All new specialists that can come into the field. And some PR cards? Oh, that's interesting. Some PR cards. Let's see how this interacts with the game. Let's look at this one. PR event. End of game. Score four victory points. 
for each full level four paddock in your, lot, in your park. Yeah. In case of like extra bonus victory conditions. Some more plot twists, like this one. Game setup. Determine turn order randomly. Phase five, hold a closed fist auction for turn order. Highest bid is first player, lowest bid is last. With ties maintain relative turn order position. That could definitely mess up your plans if you need to get something quickly and soon before someone else's turn. Modular section. Game setup. Add the blueprints module to the game. Ooh, interesting. All right, so that's that's it. Here we go. Everything that we saw in here, and I'm digging this as much as I dug everything last week with the core game. Brilliant. I can't wait. To incorporate this in the new dinosaurs and the new dice and the PR rules. Oh, I can't wait to incorporate that into this awesome game. All right, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me for this unboxing of Pandasaurus Games Dinosaur Island Holy Liquid Expansion. I'm your buddy, Big Johnny G, the Two Gun Pixel Presents Legendary Gaming, and my friends, I am.